Can you hear me now? Thank you for being here. As I said, this is the first time since we lifted the gates we're holding a rally here. Why are we here? We're here for freedom. For those in Cuba who crave it, we hear you, we support you, we are with you. There is no doubt, no question in this house when you hear from these members that we are a beacon of freedom and we will stand with anyone who craves freedom. But we need our voice to be louder and stronger because we need to hear it from Pennsylvania Avenue. Time is of the crescents. We have to stand now. We need the internet up so people understand. We need the world to understand what's going on. They need to stop the repression of bringing people into jail, bringing the kids in as well. I don't understand what it takes to make Biden move. The problems that happen in Cuba are not from America, it's from communism. America is more than countries, America is an idea. We see it in Cuba where people hold the American flag. They crave the freedom. But I will tell you, we will not wait, we will not sleep, and we will not stop until we change the regime. Until the people in Cuba have the freedom. And every freedom-loving person in the world should join with us. If you're here today, thank you. But bring more. Let's make the pressure mount. And you're going to hear from people who personally know what this regime has done, not just to their family, but to others. But I will tell you, we're stronger, and we shall win, because freedom always will. Thank you, and God bless. Thank you. Let's hear it for the next Speaker of the House.